must be that time of year, guys, springtime, because here in Georgia, we have a ton of pollen outside and it is hard to breathe. <laughs> well, every year around springtime, I love choosing some sort of plant to grow. And over the years, I've grown cabbage, watermelon, pumpkins, green beans, all sorts of stuff. And this year, I've chosen to plant and grow uh, sunflowers. I've chosen two different kinds and I will show you the progress on those right now. These are my sunflowers that I planted about two weeks ago and they're looking so good so far and I'm just so happy with the way they're turning out. Um, so stick around for all the progress and I'll show you as they grow. Well, I'm excited to see how they're gonna end up turning out and if you stick around for more of my videos, you'll get to see the progress of those sunflowers. And sunflowers are actually pretty easy to grow. You just need the seeds, potting soil, water, and a little bit of sunlight, so pretty cool. Well, yesterday I went to this uh, reptile shop called Raining Reptiles, and that's where my parents got my ball python, Xena, and she's been doing great. So I highly recommend buying reptiles from there if you're ever in Georgia or passing through um, because they have great quality reptiles there, and they have so many beautiful reptiles. And they also have these like little cats that walk around, so that's cool too. Well, I went there and I bought two hoppers, which are feeder mice, and I bought 12 crickets. I don't know why I bought just 12 crickets because today I fed one of my two leopard geckos, her name is Gator, and she ate almost all of the crickets. She left one behind, so. I was like, I have two leopard geckos and I have to feed the other one champagne. And I'm like, oh. So today I went out to Petco and I bought some crickets and also bought some mealworms because geckos love mealworms. And while I was in line, I bought this, okay? This calendar. I know we're three months into the year, but still like these kittens, these kittens are cute. And we still, we still have a good bit of the year left, so. I'll get to hang that up and see all the cute little cats. So, yeah. Also, ooh, you know when you're at the grocery store and they have like the candy on the side there and you're just sitting there and you're like, I'm not gonna buy candy, not gonna buy candy. Well, I bought candy for my cats. And I just love the way this cat looks on the back. He's like, I got, kept, <laughs> I got catnip and <laughs> I'm loving life. So my cats are gonna be loving life, yeah. Um, also, I don't know if I ever showed you guys this catnip mist, but it's pretty cool. I got it from Walmart and my cats love it. Like, I'll spray it on a cat toy, they'll go over and just start playing with it. And actually, I sprayed it on a sock the other day and they started playing with that sock too. So that was, that was pretty funny to watch. Um, after Petco, I went over to this uh, craft store called Hobby Lobby and I bought a bunch of canvas and paints and stuff and I've been doing a lot of painting lately and I'm putting all my paintings on Etsy so if you ever see one that you like if you follow me on Instagram or if I show you one here in one of these videos then you can go over to my Etsy shop and I also sell other things like bracelets and stuff like that so definitely check out my Etsy so shop and I'll include the link to that in the description area of this video and I actually want to show you one of the paintings I did here recently this is Figment the Dragon He's from Epcot at Disney World in Orlando. And I just, I love Figment. Ever since I was like real young, I've loved Figment and I love dragons. I wanted to paint a painting of him because he's just so fun looking. And I actually got a pop figure of Figment that is really cute. My boyfriend actually gave, gave it to me for Christmas and I love it. So you might say I'm a bit of a Figment fan. And if you know who Figment is, then yes. <laughs> but yeah, so. I think that's about it for this vlog. Actually, I think I wanna show you guys my cats playing with the catnip. I'll show you the catnip mist and then I'll show you the the lovely candy I got for them. Hey, Emma. They love it already. <laughs> I also got this little toy mouse. Let's see what happens when I spray the catnip mist on it. Oh, that's another thing. I've grown catnip in the past. So I should find some more seeds, grow some more, because I love the catnip. Willow's checking out the toy here. Hee <laughs> hee. Sometimes she does this thing where she scoots, where she scoots along the carpet. I'm gonna see if she does that. Her eye on the mouse. Ah, hee <laughs> hee. She does. She doesn't even crawl over to it. Oh, and Emma with the catnip. Let's tilt that back up for you. <laughs> Just 
And Willow has found a new toy, her own tail. You like your tail? <laughs> Why even watch TV when you got cats and catnip? Oh, I think we gotta hide the rest of this catnip. Just give her a little bit to play with. Hee <laughs> Let's see if she'll do more of that scooting stuff. Oh, Emma wants it now. Actually, oh, she's scooting this way. <laughs> I love the way she does that. It's so funny. Yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you come back for more. Bye.